The M2 Bradley Infantry Fighting Vehicle is nominally used to carry infantry into battle, but is frequently misidentified by journalists as a tank. As the track vehicle currently tips the scales at 33 tons from all the add-on armor it has received and bristles with both a 25mm Bushmaster automatic cannon and a tow anti-tank missile launcher. The U.S. Army's Bradleys have likely seen even more use in combat than the more famous M1 Abrams main battle tank. In swirling mechanized battles in the open deserts of Iraq in the 1990-91 Gulf War, the Bradley reputedly destroyed even more armored vehicles than Abrams. Only three Bradleys were destroyed by enemy fire in that conflict. The Bradley was meant to serve as both an armored personnel carrier and a tank killer, while providing covering fire to suppress enemy troops and armored vehicles. One design requirement specified that it should be as fast as the M1 Abrams main battle tank so the vehicles could maintain formation. The Bradley Fighting Vehicle is a combat-proven platform that provides outstanding survivability, mobility, and lethality and is an integral part of the U.S. Army's Armored Brigade Combat Team. The M2 Bradley Primary Armament is a 25mm chain gun using either 100 or 300 rounds per minute, accurate to 3,000 M approximately 2 miles. It is also armed with a tow missile launcher capable of carrying two loaded missiles. The missiles, capable of destroying most tanks to a maximum range of 4,000 meters. The Bradley also carries a coaxial 7.62mm medium machine gun to the right of the 25mm chain gun. BAE Systems has acted as the manufacturer and systems integrator of the Bradley program for over 30 years, including conducting various upgrades based on customer needs and mission requirements. Over the life of the Bradley program, there have been several survivability upgrades, including installation of underbelly protection and the Bradley Urban Survivability Kits, further enhancing the safety of one of the most survivable vehicles in the fleet.